In this video, I'll show you how to black out or redact texts from a PDF for free without using Adobe Acrobat Pro DC. Welcome to this video. My name is David. I hope you're well wherever you are. Here's the PDF I need to redact some uh, sections from. Let's assume you want to redact this particular title or maybe anything else inside here. So how can we do it without using Adobe Acrobat Pro DC? We can redact or black out the text using an application called LibreOffice Draw. And this is uh, an application I've covered on the channel a couple of times. So I'll leave a link to LibreOffice, the whole suite. But this is LibreOffice Draw. So what we need to do is we need to open our PDF, this particular PDF file inside LibreOffice. Let's just close it out so that we don't get conflicts uh, that another application is using uh, that particular PDF and then go to file, open the particular PDF that we want to redact the text or black out the text from, click on open, and this is our text. So uh, we want to potentially, let's say, redact this particular title. And these are things that you see in classified files and uh, the reason for actually doing reduction of uh, PDFs or blacking out the text is to protect sensitive information. So. This is how you do it inside LibreOffice Draw. So I'll begin by first of all, uh, magnifying this from 61% to about 100%. Let's just zoom in. And once we zoom in, because I want us to see uh, the particular section where we're going to be uh, reducting clearly. Once we do that, let's go to Tools and then Reduct. And then we are going to choose how we want to reduct. Let's say we want to reduct uh, like a rectangle for uh, the reduction. Once we do that, a draw tool is going to appear with a rectangle beneath it. So you can see it. And then all you need to do is just select the section where you want to redact. Let's say it's this title. I'll just draw over it and I'll hold the left click key and, and move to the end. Once I do that, by default, uh, the reduction is uh, using this particular uh, light gray color. So one thing that you can do is that you can click uh, on this and then you can use the handles to move the text where you want it to be so that uh, it moves clearly uh, or so that you can actually ensure that it covers the section that you want it to cover. So let's say we want it to cover up to that particular section. Next up, we need to change this particular color. So to change this, just click on this and then come to this particular section. Let's go to the area and then look for the fill color. There are different options here, a gradient, hatching, bitmap, a pattern, whatever you want. If you click on pattern, you see what you get. And then you can change the percentages, uh, sphere, zigzag, whatever. But let's work with fill color. Let's just click on color and then select the color to be a solid black because we want to black out this particular text. And once we do that, there is the option for this particular transparency for this particular solid. So if we go to this side, you can still see this particular uh, section. But if we bring it down to zero, then we are going to black out this particular text. So we've actually reducted these particular texts from people seeing what is there. We've protected this particular sensitive information. So if that is all you wanted to do, that is the only process you wanted to do. Remember to save your file. Let's go to file. Let's go to export us, export as PDF, export, and then rename. We can just do redacted as the extension for that particular title and click on save. And once we click on save, we can just close this out. We don't want to save that particular change to that. And then if we just double click on this, and then it's going to open up with a redacted title in here. So clearly we have used LibreOffice Draw to black out or redact text from a PDF without using Adobe Acrobat Pro. So that's how easy it is using free tools to redact text from a PDF. Thanks for watching. My name is David. Until next time, stay safe and never stop learning. Thanks for watching.